Hey you guys, welcome to my channel. It's me, Candice the Aries, coming to you guys today with a review on um, two items that I purchased from Romwe. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly, I don't know, um, and No Fashion Style. So if you guys are interested in watching that, stay tuned. No Fashion Style, try it, y'all. Okay. Let's get right into it. So, um, I'm always, you know, looking for some love zeals and all of that. Um, so I had seen like an ad on face, not on Facebook, you know what it was actually on YouTube. It was like a little advertisement on somebody's YouTube page. I don't remember. I mean, I was on everybody's page. So I was like, okay, you know, let me go check their page out because they said they had like some reasonably priced items. And I'm like, okay, let me go on and see. So they were advertising a comforter set that was like adorable, you know. Here's the comforter set. Super cute, right? I know. I wanted to use it as like a little backdrop setup for uh, my camera, like when I'm filming and things like that. So I thought that, that would be pretty um, cute. Price was decent and everything like that. Um, first thing, now this is on the Romwe side I'm talking about right now. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, if somebody can help me in the comments, it would be greatly appreciated. So, um, it always pays to read the comments when you're purchasing items. Um, so, I read the comments and the comments let me know that it is not actually a comforter set. Um, it actually is a, like a cover, like a comforter cover type thing where it's like a zipper part. I'll show you right here. And uh, you just unzip it and you put your blanket inside of that inside it looks like a flat sheet but it's not you can actually put it in so it came with that it came with two pillowcases and it also came with a flat sheet here right super cute so at first i was like man maybe i shouldn't purchase it and all of that because i'm like it's not even a comforter but i'm not gonna lie i'm not really mad about it because um i was like oh i can use it as kind of like a duvet type thing you know i could put a comforter in there and make it like a comforter um a different type of comforter or i could put like a fleece blanket in it or like a little throw and make it more like a little like a duvet so i was excited about that so i purchased a queen because i have a queen bed when i got after i purchased it i was like man i should have got a king because it didn't come with a fitted sheet it just came with a flat sheet so i'm like oh man you know i know queens will fit they'll you know come over on the sides and things like that but it with a king it'll actually like drape and i like the drape so I was like, okay, fine, you know, I'll just work with the queen. So first when I opened it up, I was like, this is kind of small to be a queen. But I was like, you know, not finna trip on it. I'll show you how to pitch it again. I was able to like hold it up from like arm to arm and I shouldn't have been able to do that, you know, that whatever. So I actually put the cover in and when I tell you guys, look, look at this. Hey y'all, so this is the queen comforter cover i guess you can call it i guess it's a queen if what justifies it being a queen is it could fit on the top part these leaves are coming off uh it just fits over the legit y'all it's it's almost funny literally like right over the top the leaves are coming off kind of bluish but they're like well, you yeah, know, they are kind of bluish. So, back to the video. Did they or did they not try it? Did they or did they not try it? They said, oh, it's a queen. It's a queen just from the, the top dimensions. It's a queen. Wayne said it was going to hang up. So, in the picture, which is here. I want to know what size bed they were using for that type of drape. Like, was it like a twin? Was it like a elevated toddler bed? I don't know. Um, everything else came as is. So not too upset about that purchase. Now, on to No Fashion Style. Now, I saw No Fashion Style on Facebook. And, you know, I went and I looked at the comments. And in the comments, people was like, oh, yeah, I got my dress. I got my skirt. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. And I'm like, oh, man, okay. Let me find out that I got some place that I can go find me some reasonable uh, clothes from. Clothes are really nice. So, this is the outfit that I ordered. Don't get up under my comments uh, 
talking about this outfit first of all i was trying to find an outfit that was like a decent price where if i didn't get the item i wouldn't be too upset about it um i was gonna rock this out with some cute little strappy shoes and a little yellow little half up half down hair with some cute little oh, I really look like, don't play with me y'all that was the outfit was gonna be popping it was gonna be nice it was gonna be real nice but um that's what i ordered and this is what i got First of all, I wouldn't even attempt to try that on. That is absolute. I would never wear anything like that. I would never wear anything that revealing, um, like as a whole. You know, I you you. I feel like you need to show the legs or the upper part. I don't, don't do both. I feel like both is just too much. And it was super super short. Like I tried it on off camera. Of course, it was super short and very raised in the back. And I was like, oh no, but. The gag is, I'ma wear like a um like a bodysuit. Here we go. Of course, I wouldn't dress. I would dress it up. I wouldn't wear the pants or you know I would do accessories, do some difference to my hair. You know, make a little cutie cute. But they did not send me the item that I ordered, and I was like. Um, needless to say, no fashion style is a N.O. for me. I will not be purchasing from them again. I'm going to stick to the places that I've been purchasing my clothes from that have been reliable. And that would be Fashion Nova. And that's what it is. I will not be dealing with these uh, side cups. Not this one in particular. Now, I am open and willing to deal with another um, company if I see them and they have some reason for stuff and I'm try it out. You know, I'm willing to do that. But no fashion style. I No. Um, as far as Romwe, would I purchase from them again? You know what? I'm going to say no. Maybe I wouldn't purchase these companies. They have a, not a lot of cute accessories on their website that I probably um, would purchase um, because they have a lot of nice accessories. But as far as their comforter sets, no, because I feel like if that's a king, if that's a queen, the video that I showed you guys, if that's a queen, then the king probably just goes over the size just a little. And no, I'm not rebuying for a second disappointment. Like, fool me once, you know. So that's what it is. So, now getting to the goody goods. Let's go ahead and um, do the price breakdown. I'm going to start off with um, Romwe. Romwe. Maybe it is Romwe. Is it Romwe? Romwe? I don't know. I told y'all. Let me know. So, I'm going to start off with um, Romwe. And then I'm going to go to No Fashion Style. I have my laptop right next to me. So, I'm going to get this information with you guys, um, to you guys. And then I will be right back. Okay. So, we're back. Welcome back, you guys. Um, so I'm going to start with Romwe. I'm going to have to look over to the side to just look at the prices really quickly and then I'll be back, you know, looking at you beauties. So, here we go. So, I purchased the comforter set, um, from uh, Romwe and I'll put all this information in the description below also. I purchased it on the 14th of July. Yes, the 14th of July tripping tripping i purchased it on the 14th of july i received it on the 20th of july um the total came out to be 31.55 um it originally retailed at 33.95 but i ended up getting a three dollars and forty cents um discount I think it was because it was like my first time on the site, so they gave me like a little discount code. Um, so I got that, and then they char they charged me at ninety nine cents insurance. What is it called? Shipping insurance, whatever. And the actual shipping was free, so it ended up coming out to be thirty one fifty five. Now that was for the Rom Wee. Now with no fashion style, I purchased that item on July. 15th and I received it on the 22nd of July and that total came out to be $25.76. Um, the product price, the item for the dress here was $15.81. They did not give me a discount. The shipping cost was $9.95 
They did not charge me any insurance, unlike Romwe with their 99 cent shipping insurance that I've never heard of before, but whatever. Um, and so with the shipping and the 1581 for the price and the 995 for the shipping, the total came out to be 2576. And that was for the no fashion style um set that I did not receive. And they ended up giving me a black dress. And that dress is thick. The material is thick. I like legit cannot wear that in the summertime. Like I that would have to be like a fall type top, even though it's low cut in the front, like it's hot just saying y'all so um the one thing that i will say um about the no fashion style site the more items that you purchase the higher the shipping cost is so just for this dress the shipping was nine dollars and 95 cents but it's like if you order like um if you if you order a lot of items then your your shipping cost will go up and I, at first i was wondering like how can they the pictures of the items that they have, <clears throat> excuse me, you guys, the pictures of the items that they have are really nice clothing, but they have them at a really discounted price. And I was like, man, I wonder how they're able to sell it at that discounted price and still make a profit. They're making a profit on the shipping, y'all. Ain't nobody got time for that. So I was not pleased with that shipping. I did not get the item. Nah. I'm still mad at that because you know what? That's not something that normally happens to me. Um, I've It's very, very rare. I could count on one hand and I wouldn't even need all my fingers how many times I've actually made a purchase um, from a site that I saw online, especially after I've done my research and um, I didn't get the items. Like it was people on YouTube that had got their items. I didn't, I got a item. I didn't get the item that I purchased. I mean, I did get something. Thank, thankfully, it was something that I could, you know, maneuver into something that I could still use and still wear and wouldn't have to just throw it away because if I had to pay $9.95 to get it shipped to me, I don't even want to think about how much they would try to charge me to ship it back because you know they're not about to pay for you to ship it back. They be real extra with that. So, that's it, you guys. So that is my review for Romwe, um, the comforter set, and the no fashion style um, two-piece set that I did not get. I probably will, like I said before, I probably will shop again at Romwe. No fashion style is a no for me. I'm, I'm done. done, done. So that's it, you guys. If you guys like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, that's going to be it for me, Candace the Aries. And always remember to enjoy the journey. Step on, I'll keep you in. I'll summer